Good morning everyone. Uh, this is a beautiful morning up in the north of England and I wanted to do this week's story hack on, I don't know if you can see this behind me, I've taken some time this morning before I start work to come out and walk down this incredible canal um, and be outside even though it's cold. Um, and this is what today's story hack is about, or life hack if you will. It's about taking the time and choosing to connect, choosing to connect with the earth around us, wherever we find ourselves. Um, I'm in the middle of a beautiful town called Hebden Bridge in the north of England. Um, and yes, you can hear the traffic noise behind me and people are waking up and going about their day, but there's also this incredible beauty unfolding around me in the earth of the early autumn landscape and it's frosty up on the hills and it, the air is crisp. In the next week I'm going to be appearing on something with my aunt Brooke Medicine Eagle, a free summit she's doing called Returning to Earth, Becoming Fully Human. And last night we recorded our interview and we both were struck about how we have to choose connection. We have to consciously choose to carve out, whether it's 10 minutes or an hour, or even two minutes in our day, to come outside and connect with Earth. Becoming fully human is about realizing we're fully Gaian as well. We belong to this incredible ecosystem. And sometimes when we're in the middle of our working week and you know, we're going about our to-do lists and our diaries and we're driving around in our cars or whatever that might be, it's too easy to forget that. It's too easy to forget that we are part of a much bigger family than just the human one. So this week, I encourage you to take some time, even if it's just 10 minutes like I have this morning, to come out and breathe the fresh air and look at all of the Gaian community around you, not just the human one. Because when we return to Earth truly, and we come back to our place in the family of all things on this planet, we come home. You know, we come home really. And we come home to our bodies, to our stories about who we are as human beings. And we come home to this incredible responsibility and honor we have as human beings to take care of the ecosystems around us, to listen to them, to just be in them. <laughs> so wherever you are this morning, whether you're out on the land, whether you're in the country, whether you're in the middle of a city, like I find myself in the middle of this beautiful town today, go outside, breathe, become fully human by becoming fully Gaian and choose to connect. And I will see you all next week.